Get a spot and start cutting. Like the glue that bonds these two pieces of fabric. The blue is for Saugus and then the orange is for mass shootings. 14-year-old Haley Hernandez is working with her mom to bring people together. We have 15 rolls, so we're actually, we can make like 9,000 now. They're assembling more than 5,000 ribbons to hand out at tomorrow's vigil. I got really shaken up from it because it was so close. And so I think that people knowing that other people care is going to help them feel comforted. The Heart High student says it's important to be a beacon of hope. They will be able to see like a light in a dark situation. And she's not doing it alone. We probably had maybe like 60 people in and out overall today. Tiffany Hernandez rallied the troops via posts on social media. Strangers, this is from Facebook. I just posted it and it kind of grew from there. People giving up their weekend. Each of them using their hands to help fasten together symbols of support. We're a community and that's just what we do. We have to love on each other and support each other, you know, the same way we would want someone to do for us. That's just what we do. And what we do is stand strong, hand in hand, united as one. I don't want my kids living in fear. It's that's not okay. Like we have an amazing God who will protect us all, and I, I know some people don't want to hear it right now, and I get it, I get it. We're in tragedy, but one day at a time, we will get through this. Thursday's tragedy sent waves throughout our community, but now we're focusing on how we can uplift each other. We will be SCV strong, we will be Saga strong, and together we'll get through it. Reporting in a healing Santa Clarita, I'm Austin Dave.